Well, this has been a long road and we are very, very excited uh, to hand over this project uh, to the community. Um, this project was initiated by Wimpy in 2019 already. And then due to COVID and to various delays, we, uh, we had to postpone the project a couple of times and uh, now finally we can hand over, um, which is for us a very, very privilege and we are finding it very exciting to hand over or to initiate a project like this where we give lighting or something back to the community. In this case, it's lighting. Um, and we have provided solar lights to this installation, which covers around three kilometers of road um, through very rural areas where there was no lighting before. Um, and we believe that this is going to create safety and uh, of course a uh, sort of a quality of living to the people here beyond Sunset, which they didn't have before. My name is Sylvia Sepugu. I'm the CEO of Moere Ganyeni Technical Services and the founder of Intel Power Trading, a company that is partnering with Bika Schrader in South Africa. I just want to appreciate uh, Bika Schrader uh, for this particular project. Um, that has made history in our country, in our province, rural community development with bigger shredder. But here I am today, my young generation, they are seeing the light right in their rural because of the possibility that was made by Bika Shredder. I want to thank uh, King Baldwin Foundation. I want to thank the uh, Shredder family. I want to thank the leadership of Daniel Kasper and his team. Uh, they've dedicated their time to come and be with us today to celebrate with us as we hand over the project to the community of Chilapene village with our kingship, His Majesty King uh, Kennedy Midiabadu Chibase and uh, our other chief is working with us who is number one supporter of Bika Shredder called Simwere Kanyi Chibase. I'm very much excited, we are celebrating. The weather was good, everything was perfect. Vimpi has been honored, he deserves it. And we want to say transformation that brings the real change is what we need in South Africa. We need companies like Bika, we need companies and leadership like from Bika who will say rural communities is where all leaders were born. I thank you. I think that this is a really partnership with the, with the community. Um, the traditional leaders and the community working together as one well. is very much important. Because we are in the villages here, you know everybody is talking about smart cities. And uh, we also here are now talking smart villages. And that is where we are going because we are saying there is this fourth industrial revolution which is unavoidable and therefore our people uh, must be here and uh, move with the time and make sure that everything is uh, is perfect. You see, like Masindi here, she has been very happy uh, with the project. Uh, she She's able now to walk at night <laughs> uh, and as before, she couldn't. Now she walks at night because there is always light. Hmm? She is uh, a citizen here in the village for many, many years. I think this is so great. I mean, we, we thank uh, Baker Schrader for coming up with uh, this effective uh, solution which can be applied uh, within uh, different villages uh, here in our place. Do not need to go to the Saori. What do you want to do? 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 Okay, I now come back the next time to be chairperson Kayu. Your permission to come. Eh, my fungi no project here, my bon. So a community, but we talk about land, we want development. In a Kosia Shu, we are the can. Now we are the sum. We are the chair. We are the one. 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 We are the
ya usumbe zori karibe shishini riche zari ziko rifun zari nesa wa shori jambori kutu uchila kacheza radadan uchila kashishi Thanks to the Shreda Foundation, we were able to uh, fund this project um, and of course uh, we are hoping that of course with uh, future projects like this we can even create a bigger impact to the community um, and of course the idea is to expand on several similar projects uh, around South Africa because we have very very uh, many communities like this who are having the same uh, situation and have, uh, facing the same challenges um, so we believe that this uh, is just a the first step of many steps to come.